the best, moist, juiciest, and tastiest turkey breast you've ever had. Check it out. Eat delicious with Chef Pachi. So the first thing we're going to do is we are going to make sure that our breast is totally, totally defrosted. We don't want to defrost it in water. We want to defrost it in its container so that none of that amazing turkey is wasted. If you still feel that it's a little frozen, just put it under some running water with its package and leave it there for about 15 minutes, half an hour, whatever you need. So we remove the net from the breast. We are gonna keep it because I'm gonna show you something you can do. Now we're gonna mix all of the seasonings that we have frozen. Remember, we don't wanna be smelling like garlic or onions or having to go out and buy cilantro or Dijon mustard or anything the days around the holidays. We wanna have everything pre-made so that we can cook and we don't have to go anywhere and we enjoy the moment. We mix all the seasonings with the yogurt and we add some sattar. If you can find sattar, you can add peel of an orange or maybe two limes. Now we're gonna cut the breast in half because we wanna make it thinner. That way it's gonna have more surface space and more taste. So we open it and we're gonna season it everywhere. Don't worry if there's a little hole here and there, it's all gonna get stuck onto the other, no problem. As you leave it in the fridge during the 24 hours for seasoning, it glues itself together, it's amazing. So now we add some pepper and some salt in the inside. We add the center of the breast, which you can also slice if you feel it might be easier. I usually slice it and then add all the dressing on it. We want it all to be seasoned because every single bite is gonna be perfectly delicious. You see, there it was open. Here we have our net for later. So what I do is that I tie it and if you can't tie it like this, one, two, three, four, five, or six ties around and each one with a knot and that's it. Do not worry, it's nothing out of this world. Then you add more seasoning on top, whatever's left over. And finally, you can put at the end, if you see the end has many small pieces, some foil, because the foil is gonna prevent it from coming out while it's cooking. Check out how we put that net back on it. It's not that easy, but it's not that hard. And it keeps it perfectly in your fridge. Now you can put this in a container or a bag and refrigerate it for 24 hours or at least 12 hours and it's gonna be the perfect turkey breast. Here we go. We're gonna be ready to put it in the oven and what we have is a baking pan with two racks and we want the racks because we want to have a sauce with this turkey breast. Now we recut that net because it's the easiest way to get rid of it. You don't have to put the net, but I wanted to show you that you could in case you felt more confident. But actually, just some knots work perfectly. It won't come apart. Now we preheat the oven at 475. Add the turkey breast, close the oven, and then turn down immediately the temperature for the next 90 minutes. And check it out, it's perfect. Look at the drippings. The drippings have a beautiful color. We're gonna add a little bit of wine, and if you don't like wine, you can add some non-alcoholic wine or applesauce, and this, we're gonna pass it through a sieve. Now we're mixing some Greek yogurt, which we're gonna add some almond milk to, and then we'll add the drippings. For some reason, I added the yogurt to the drippings cup, I don't know why, but you first pass the drippings through a sieve, and then you add the yogurt. These things happen once in a while. 
I do crazy things, but they come out fine. That, that makes you feel, you know, it's going to work perfectly. No matter how you do it, it's going to work. So we pass it through a sieve, and since it's too heavy, it all comes out of the cup. But everything works perfectly. It comes out nice. And now we've given our breast some time to cool down. We need to leave it covered with foil for about 10 minutes. Look at the moisture of this breast. It's amazing, delicious. Chef Pachi, delicious food, amazing mood. Enjoy.